Don't you ever think I've forgiven you because I have not and I will not. A sentencing for the man who created a staggering number of videos of young women, his gymnastics girls, in the nude. James Cavisto was the trusted man who ran their gymnastics gym. Since that day in March, my panic disorder and my depression have worsened. I have had panic attacks to the point where I completely pass out. Dozens of victims, at least 90 in the criminal complaint, many under 18 on 185 videos recorded on cameras in a bathroom at the Wind Lake Gymnastics Center in Racine County over four years. A mother, herself a victim, questions whether she can tell her daughter to trust adults. How can I do that when one of the most trusted people in her life chose to betray her? Every time I enter the locker room, I search for cameras because I'm scared that someone else is doing it to me. The victims feel dirty. They feel violated. These were kids, for God's sake. You took away their innocence. And an apology from the man who hid the cameras and said he sexually pleased himself watching the videos. I would like to start by saying I'm sorry for what I have done and for the pain and suffering I've caused so many great people and families. There is no excuse for what I have done. Some 90 victims, Terry, so some people might wonder why the sentence was only 17 years in prison. Well, Joyce, many of the counts were dropped from 46 counts down to 16 counts, some child pornography possession, as well as invasion of privacy. That angered a lot of parents who wanted him sentenced to prison for life. And some of those victims, Joyce, use words like shattered trust, betrayal, and nightmares. Powerful testimony. Terry Sater reporting live in Racine County.